Hey, it's your boy again, TJ. LSU dad. I almost forgot I had a prediction I wanted to get out of the way. Other than my Tigers winning it all in 2018, right? I have a second runner-up team. <laughs> that's going That's going to be there in the end. All oh, serious, guys, um, NC State. I want to say this early, right? Because I don't wait to like a lot of these fake fans to everybody jumping on the bandwagon. I want to let you know early who's going to dominate the ACC. NC State. I got NC State knocking off Miami. Got NC State knocking off Clemson. Put me down for it. Put me down for it. This is the year that NC State run the table over there. And yeah, I know they, they lost some key people on the defensive line. I know they got to rebuild that. I know they lost a couple of linebackers, but they got the depth. But that quarterback, that quarterback they have over there at NC State, I think is, is right. Other than the kid at, at Ole Miss, I think he's going to be the number. It's going to be a battle between, between this kid at Ole Miss, right, Jordan, and that quarterback over at NC State. That could be the best two quarterbacks in the country, right? So I'm just letting you know early because I am the football prophet. <clears throat> Keep your eye on NC State. You know, I was right when I called UCF. And I told all of y'all all year, I said UCF and Georgia, right? And I'm not knocking those programs. I'm not saying that those programs are taking a step back. I'm saying that because actually I think UCF is going to be better this year than they were last year. If that's even possible, I think they could be better. But keep your eye on NC State. This is the year, guys, that they step up. And, and knock off Clemson, push it aside, Miami. We're going to soften them up for you, NC State. It's your boy, TJ. Go Tigers!